Let's talk about like an inflammatory diet, for example, which foods scientifically shown contribute to inflammation. Well, we know that meat contributes to cancer and inflammation, all kinds of meat, especially red meat and processed meat. Since 2000, the year 2000, there's been three made analyses that have looked at massive amounts of data and studies from around the world with hundreds of thousands of people that have shown red meat intake is a significant risk factor for cancer. What are some of the reasons that scientists think this is? Well, TMAO is produced in the body from dietary carnitine. Carnitine is found in animal muscle tissue. We know that carnitine is not necessarily an essential nutrient for human consumption because our bodies make it internally, the amount that we need. But TMAO is also a molecule that's linked to cardiovascular disease, which is often due to chronic inflammation. So that's one reason that uh, scientists believe that meat contribute to cancer and chronic inflammation and why you may want to consider reducing meat.